breaking news, the president declaring a national emergency. The new stay at home order. We will shut you down. Don't think you can get on a plane or a train. This is a pandemic of the unvaccinated. And we will take you to jail. We've got to get them vaccinated. Or we will keep you in a facility longer. As the world was descending into synchronized tyranny, I began to ask myself, how did they get everyone to go along with this? Oh, it feels so good. I know. <laughs> Obsessed with finding the answer, I began studying every moment in recorded history where masses of people acted against their own self-interest. The only mechanism that could explain what was happening in society Screw your freedom. You're a schmuck. Was what is usually referred to as mass formation. Here we are now with an economy in crisis, but with an incredible opportunity. Unprecedented opportunity for a reset. Your Royal Highnesses, distinguished heads of state and government, the future is built by us. We need a great reset. When they say you'll be happy, what they mean is you'll be enslaved. Today, we have the technology to hack human beings on a massive scale. Who masters those technologies will be the master of the world. Those who control the data control the future, not just of humanity, but the future of life itself. Every aspect of our life has been infiltrated by people that do not have our best interests at heart. There are forces using fear and isolation to induce mass psychosis. I don't want you to be hopeful. Environmental doom. Fires. I want you to panic. Storms. It will kill your children. I want you to feel the fear I feel every day. People are starting to wake up. They're starting to wake across the world. I'm seeing people come together from all walks of life, finally saying enough is enough. We didn't come here for no reason. We have a voice and we're here to share it. We have to be the solution. We cannot rely on the media, the president, or whoever to fix these problems. I would rather pick up cans on the side of the highway than to live out of alignment with my truth. We're all being driven back to the dream. As you see in the audience, Democrats, Republicans, white, Black, everyone all in between. This is the example that they do not want to see, but they have no choice. The masses of humanity have been slapped awake. Open your eyes. It's time to wake up. This is the Great Awakening. People cannot go back into the Matrix now. A lot of people are trying to. They can't.